<laughs> more exciting and um, glamorous part of my work, I guess, is the field work. For me, it's involved doing live captures of wolverines and putting out GPS collars on the animals that we that we catch uh, to try to get a better sense of their habitat associations in particular. You can think of a way to study wolverines. We've, we've pretty much tried it on this project. So we started out um, doing aerial occupancy surveys. So this was just um, using airplanes, fixed wing airplanes. Um, They're just two-seater airplanes, so very small aircraft. And they um, went out for three years and did surveys of a large, large portion of the North Slope of Alaska. Once we got a better sense of where, where they were and the areas that we could reliably expect to find them, we, we moved on to a live capture collaring um, effort. So that was using these um, wooden box traps that we, that we pulled out onto the tundra with a snowmobile. It's made out of uh, four by four lumber, two or three feet wide, about the same tall and about five feet long. And the lid um, is on hinges at one end, so it lifts up at the other end and is supported by a cable uh, that goes up to a cross piece above it. So the idea is there's a piece of bait, uh, rotten, stinky meat is ideal um, in the back of the trap, and that's connected to that cable that's holding the lid open. And so the idea is the wolverine goes in and pulls on the bait and it releases the lid, uh, which, which traps them inside.